Hi y'all. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Johnny on the trail. This is Lisa. I'm and just Lisa. Today we're going to hike. There you go. Old Settlers Trail. Last time I hiked this trail was with my sister and we had to uh, outrun some yellow jackets. We had a standoff with a copperhead and we waded a creek about waist deep. So let's see what today has in store for us. So this morning we started off with it raining. It was raining pretty good when we got up at uh, well, it was really three, but four o'clock because today is daylight savings time. And right as we got to the trail, it's mud flat. Um, it stopped raining. The fog is clearing out, and it is going to be an absolutely gorgeous day. And if y'all wondering what I'm carrying here, it's a yummy kale blueberry spinach healthy drink cheers I got up <laughs> <Woo -hoo! laughs> don't laugh if I fall Today I'm wearing my new uh, Z-Pack Arctic Hall pack, so Team Z-Pack. Uh, I'll do a review on this pack um, after a few more uh, uses of it. Uh, kind of want to fill it out and see how it uh, how it's uh, how it hauls and um, see how it performs with me. See if we are a good match because I feel like um, for everything to work together, you have to be a match. And the Green Family Cemetery is right up that trail there. That way is not the trail on OST. So let me know in the comments below where that goes. It's a pretty dominant uh, main way. The OST goes on up that way. Hey guys, we're while we're out here on OST hiking, uh, we can't help but think of uh, Mike Maples and keeping he and his family friends and her thoughts and prayers. This is part of the Smokies that uh, Mike loved so much. And he knew so much about this area. Um, you know, he knew home sites and grave sites and so so much history of this area. But it's nice to, to be out today and it's beautiful um, today out hiking this. He's actually being buried today, so that's why we're mentioning that. Mm -hmm. about what a beautiful day it is and um, if Johnny will do a shoot so it's officially wearing shorts and a tank top it is March the 10th and it's beautiful out here it's a gorgeous day so glad we're out here <laughs> Thank you. 
we just stopped back there and had lunch and it is so hot Whew. but no complaints with the heat though brings out the bugs we've got about four and a half five miles left of ost not a bad day We just have three and a half miles left of the trail, but in all honesty, um, this is pretty much how the whole trail has been today. It's been very interactive and uh, lots of trees. It's been fun. <laughs> the struggle is real. You get over one hurdle and then you'll be smacked in the face on the other side. blow down out here but we're gonna go across this creek and regroup we, at the uh, bottom of we're the hill pretty sure we know a, which direction to go but we're just going to get off this embankment get out of these trees and uh, regroup and find the trail again i'm gonna do a little sweep real quick let you see what we've been really wasn't a defined trail up here anywhere so and then we have to cross the creek at the bottom well, we're back on the trail, but we're not sure if we go that way or that way from where we came, which was way up on top of the ridge. So we think maybe the trail came down back behind us and goes back out this way. Um, I'm not gonna pull my map out right yet and look. I don't feel like I'm lost. So we're gonna hike on this way and see where it goes. Well, so far today, knock on that tree right there, my feet are dry. Lisa's been forwarding every creek by putting one foot in front of the other and hustling through. But I say yet because I remember there being one creek out here that we had to wade in about waist deep. We'll see if we have to do that today or not. this to Jeff. Awesome. <laughs> he's with Ilan today hanging out. Awesome. Because he's on vacation. I don't know if it'll work. Oh, it did. I wonder did if it, it sent. No, if it sending. don't, I know for sure at 33 you have cell service. No, I don't think this one is sending. Okay. It's not good enough cell service. To I'm send. We're with I Verizon. I am. So I'm Johnny. Yeah. I'm Molly. 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 Nice to so. Thank you. Well. So you're, uh, you often... Thank <laughs> you. 
T. McCarter Barn is 600 feet to our right. show him where it was but there was like a they had made like a, a tub for him at rocks oh, cool and that's where he bathed <laughs> cool yeah big john or big jim or yeah, something no, like that that's awesome so yeah see i didn't get to i didn't get to hear all of his cool stories i had met him one time and it was just a week before his diagnosis was kind of Mm -hmm. known and so I didn't get to know it. Here is the T. McCarter barn and I believe Mike Maples in one of his videos maybe even his book talks about this being haunted maybe because he and some friends came down here late one night and kind of spooked each other <laughs> Wow, it's, it's a very nice preservation job, isn't it? Yeah. Corn crib. Wow, I'd be so scared to have um, a fire so close to Sherry was telling us that there was a spring house right down here, just past uh, the McCarter barn. So we're gonna walk on down a little bit further and check out the spring house. fetch your water from this it wouldn't freeze they could keep water running all year long looks like there might have been another home site here maybe here with all these walls around the OST I'm kind of feeling like I'm craving a taco Mexican food it is. Yeah. We are nearing the end of OST for today. It's a beautiful day. Glad to be back out in the Smokies. Just a great day to reflect. final steps on the OST to have it through hot in one day. A through hike of OST, a through hike of OST is now completed. Hallelujah. Dang. It's been a long day. Lots of blow down on the trail. Yeah. But we're here. Hey, it's snack time. Yes. I'm going to shut the camera down, take the pack off, yes. have a snack. All right, after the first summer hike, 19 point, what was it, 19.6? Mixing a scratch. I think I deserve it. Thank you, Strawberry, dear, too. it's my favorite flavor. Hang on. 
So tell us what you uh, think, Lisa, about the OST. What I really think or what I think? No, I mean, what do you think of the trail? It was not a bad trail. There was a lot of blowdowns, like, I mean, probably over 50 trees. I mean, it was all day. We, probably more than that. I think every, yeah. I feel like every few steps or so, I've there was a tree. I've never had to swim through so many trees in my life. Um, but it was good. It, it's a good trail. It's a long trail. Um, kind of got a little over it at the end. <laughs> but we're finally done. So mm -hmm. we just have 1.2 more to the car. Yep. Had to have a little snack. A little snack, a little scratch. Yeah. And we're going to hike ourselves out and go get something to eat. I'm sitting here feeding the flies right now. It's only March. I can't move already out. Yeah. All right. So today's hike is done. We're at the end of Madre and Bald Trails Head uh, on Baxter Road. Uh, good, as, good spot as any to close out our video. On for some tacos. On for some tacos. Hey, live free, hike often. And mm. make every day a great day. Guess where we are? <laughs> no way, Jose's Cantina. No way.